Hi guys and welcome to Groshi's update here on Groshi Automotive. This is the second time I have to film this because my file was corrupt or something so I hope I remember everything I said on the first take. But one thing I definitely remember is to thank you guys first of all. Thank you so much for the support I've gotten. Um, we have gone past 500 subscribers right now um, this week and I'm extremely happy about that. You know, we are growing slowly but steadily and that's what makes me happy. And yeah, thank you so much guys. Uh, it wouldn't be possible without you obviously. But yeah, I'm back in the United States as you can probably tell. I had a good time in Germany. I filmed quite a lot of cars with Felix, my cameraman. I went to some events. Um, yeah, this week I got some great news from Lamborghini. I will get a Lamborghini Huracan Spider in a month um, to test for a couple of days. And Felix will be here in Los Angeles with his partner. And we will be able to bring you guys some amazing pictures of that car, hopefully. No, no, definitely. I promise you guys, that will be amazing. And I can't wait to show you guys that. And I thought, you know, I should maybe ask you what do you guys want to see us do with the Lamborghini Huracan Spider? Is there anything in particular that very much interests you um, that has to be legal, of course? I mean, in the United States, I cannot go 200 miles per hour in that car, so don't even ask me to do that. But yeah, if you have any questions, ideas, uh, anything, just please leave it in the comments below. I will definitely read every single comment. I mean, that's the nice thing about being in such a small community. I can actually really, you know, talk to you guys one-on-one -on -one, and that's quite a lot of fun. I enjoy that. But until then, of course, I will post some other car reviews that I filmed in Germany. So please uh, keep your eyes out for them as well. We really tested some interesting cars and yeah, right now I'm just struggling a lot with arranging them in the right order so it all makes sense to you. Because if in one review I mention a car that I have also reviewed but you haven't seen the video yet, then it doesn't make sense, right? So I have to really edit them and arrange them in the right way. That's why this weekend I won't post any review but next weekend there should be one review. I can't tell you which car it will be because I don't know yet. So please just stay tuned. Um, please tell your friends about it. Please share it with other car nuts. I really appreciate it because every view counts for me and every subscriber really means a lot to me and yeah I take off my sunglasses for that as well for the personal relationship with you guys um, really appreciate the support and let's grow this make this bigger hundred thousand subscribers no I don't actually want to get that big because then I don't have any one-on-one -on -one time anymore with you guys and can't read all the comments which are really very important to me please go ahead which, which are really uh, important to me. I mean, you can see it if you click through the videos, I reply to 99% of all the comments um, because I quite enjoy that. I quite enjoy to listen to you guys. I wanna know what's your opinion? What do you guys think about the review, the car or another topic I talk about? And yeah, and I appreciate it. It's really quite a lot of fun to read them and to talk to you guys. Quite a lot of you guys seem to really like the Alfa Romeo Giulia and Giulia Quadrifoglio review, which really surprised me. I mean, I knew it's a car that, you know, has, has a lot of interest um, overall in the general public. But, um, you know, I didn't have my cameraman with me. I couldn't film really any exterior shots. And I didn't think it, it's gonna be that great, but the feedback has been fantastic. Um, some people even say it was the best Giulia review they have seen so far which you know it, it, it's very flattering and i appreciate it a lot i guess it's the new cars that you guys really want to see so i'm trying hard um, to get my hands on brand new cars like the m2 that was also one of these cars that was brand new i was one of the first ones um, to get to review it because i have quite a good connection to munich of course to bmw which definitely helped me there anyways um, that's a lot of blah 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 right now I wish you guys a nice weekend and I hope to see you guys soon on Groshi Automotive. Take care, guys. Well, but actually it isn't. You know, a Tesla Model S is more aerodynamic than this car. Unbelievable, right? Well, this car accelerates very fast. Um, we're already at 200 kilometers per hour, 220.